Getting the chance to see what last year's group did, what do you think that does for the kids coming back this year? Well, I hope that they're hungry. I think that was one of the things that um, the seniors provided for us was the leadership and the just dedication that it took to, to play at that level. Uh, the younger kids, while they have a whole different skill set, um, are you know that same desire and that work ethic is going to be important to continue. Getting DJ back for another year, what does that mean, and where are you setting the bar for him this year? Well, uh, DJ is going to set the bar for himself. He's a tremendous player. He, he's so versatile. Um, but, you know, DJ has got a burning desire to get us in a position where we can be as competitive as we were last year, and he's worked hard this summer to do that. Uh, I think his signing uh, or committing early has helped kind of leave a – lift a weight off of his shoulders a little bit but you know I'm just excited that I get one more chance with him for sure. I know it's tough because you haven't really gotten a chance to see how this team plays out on the court yet but what do you see the identity being for this group this year? How do you see it changing from last year? Well last year we could guard uh, and we really I thought were in games where we didn't play very well offensively because we defended so well. Um, and that's because we had 6-5 in a lot of positions with long arms that had great de defensive anticipation skills. Uh, our makeup is going to be a lot different this year. It's gonna, we're going to rely a lot more on helping each other defensively. We can't uh, assume that guys can shut down their individual player. So I think that's where it starts for us is, is how we're going to be able to compete defensively.